Hello there and welcome back. If you're a fan like me, you'll agree that Malcolm in the Middle 2000 stands among the greatest TV series ever. So, how about joining me today? Grab a chair, settle by the campfire, and let's relive this fantastic show together. We'll journey through the entire cast, past and present, reminiscing about those who've left us, and celebrating those who still shine. Ready? Let's dive in and rekindle some incredible memories. Frankie Muniz played the character Malcolm. He was 15 years old when the TV series ran in 2000. Check it out. At 39 years old, he's rocking a fulfilling life jam-packed with passions right here in Woodridge, New Jersey. You can't break up with me because I am filled with nothing but love and good feelings and no anger and no jealousy and none of those bad things that will... Trust doctors anymore the rest of my life. Um, I went for a long time. I was having these uh, these episodes uh, where I'd have like numbness and I. Brian Cranston played the character Hal. He was 44 years old when the TV series ran in 2000. Here he is at a cool 68, chilling in Hollywood, California, enjoying a happy life with family and friends by his side. Door shut. You haven't made a sound in a half an hour. What's going on in here? Nothing. I expect perfect behavior out of you boys tonight. Trust me, if you try anything, anything at all. He called me and said, we're doing this movie, El Camino, which is the continuation of where the Jesse Pinkman character goes. I said, absolutely, I'll do whatever you want. So I Justin Burfield played the character Reese. He was 14 years old when the TV series ran in 2000. Check it out. At 38 years old, He's rocking a fulfilling life, jam-packed with passions, right here in Los Angeles County, California. Good morning. Good morning. I feel... No! Something wrong? Do you think it's right to totally change who you are and turn your back on everything you believe in just to impress a hot guy? Burt Reynolds hot or stink? Eric Per Sullivan played the character Dewey. He was nine years old when the TV series ran in 2000. Check it out. At 33 years old, he's rocking a fulfilling life jam-packed with passions right here in Worcester, Massachusetts. Oh, night? Can you fix my bike tomorrow? Well, you're right. Saturday morning is the best time for riding. Okay, now I get it. Just go eat. Softener. Mrs. Finnegan doesn't mind taking a little time to stop the rinse cycle. And maybe it's nice to have someone who's got more to say to me than just clean your room, comb your hair, utter utter Jane Kazmarek played the character Lois in the TV series when she was 45 years old in 2000. Here she is at a cool 69, chilling in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, enjoying a happy life with family and friends by her side. If you want to breathe, you're going to have to open your mouth and let go of my son. How dare you touch my daughter? She was gnawing on my son. If you're not going to control her. White, because I didn't want to wear a wig. Yeah. Uh-huh. And then the play ended, and I kept waiting for my brown roots to grow in. Uh-oh. Oh. And I kept waiting, oh. and I kept yes. waiting, and it was like... Christopher Masterson played the character Francis in the TV series when he was 20 years old in 2000. Fast forward to today... He's a lively 44-year-old soaking up the best of life right here in Long Island, New York. Cruise ships go up there only for about six weeks in the summer. Isn't it dark there the rest of the year? I don't have to justify myself to you. I don't have to justify my- 300, if they counted the amount of abs in that movie, it'd be 3 million. 3 million abs. Math jokes? No? <laughs> 300 is an... Craig Lamar Trailer played the character Stevie Kennerman. He was 11 years old when the TV series ran in 2000. Here he is at a cool 35, chilling in San Bernardino County, California, enjoying a happy life with family and friends by his side. I... Stevie! How could... It's... It's not even... It's hard for me to get into that flow zone to where I'm like sitting there, twisting wires, so I'm about to put it down and come back to it. But this one just kind of built upon itself. So David Anthony Higgins played the character Craig Feldspar in the TV series when he was 39 years old in 2000. 
Check it out. At 63 years old, he's rocking a fulfilling life jam-packed with passions right here in Des Moines, Iowa. Eric Nenninger played the character Eric Hansen. He was 22 years old when the TV series ran in 2000. Fast forward to today, he's a lively 46-year-old soaking up the best of life right here in St. Louis, Missouri. Time's up. My turn with the strength. <laughs> I just remember that he wanted to listen to oldies the whole way, and it was 1997, and I was a you know a kid, so I wanted to listen to hip hop music. And when he would fall asleep, I would turn on. Kenneth Mars played the character Otto Mancuser. He was 65 years old when the TV series ran in 2000. February 12, 2011, was a tough one. He left us due to pancreatic cancer at 76 years old in Granada Hills, Los Angeles, California. It's a sad loss for all of us. Ready now. Good. Here we go. Ready. Aim. Fire. Oh, come on, Fats. That's your being a coward. Well, we're just talking here. Let's say you decided to have the child. Uh, would you like it to be a little boy like this one? Evan Matthew Cohen played the character Lloyd in the TV series when he was 14 years old in 2000. Fast forward to today, and he's a lively 38-year-old soaking up the best of life right here in Orange County, California. Um... I would have loved to come back as as John in in season 15, or particularly maybe in the Gary Anthony Williams played the character Abraham Abe Kenarbin. He was 34 years old when the TV series ran in 2000. Here he is at a cool 58, chilling in Atlanta, Georgia, enjoying a happy life with family and friends by his side. If you're implying what I think you're implying, you want me to just come out and say it? I think you better. Fine. You and your poker buddies all ganged up on Black Dynamite. Yeah, yeah. Very comedic. Super stupidly funny. A lot of action, a lot of gun play, you know, because it's the old West, plus a lot. All right, let's chat. Who's your absolute favorite character from Malcolm in the Middle? Jump into the comments and spill the beans below this video. And like always, show some love. Hit that like button, subscribe for more, and ding that notification bell to never miss my new stuff. I can't wait to cook up more fantastic memories with you. Thanks a bunch, and stay tuned for more. See you all soon.